hey everybody just wanted to say hi and also let you know that right now i am delayed in uh, week six because i'm actually building this model where i am training uh, based on the videos that i've made on youtube so i am using a model called uh, animate diff which is the base model which is built upon stable diffusion and uh, what i'm doing is i'm adding a lot of weights on top of that which really just target the attention layer for the most part and uh, what i'm trying to do out of this is to get a fine-tuned model where my face and the way it moves and uh, what are sort of the gestures i make all of that is going to be part of the training data and i'm actually just starting with uh, i think 27 videos and uh, which i've done it uh, to about 179 frames uh, so very small number but uh, i believe looking at all the literature that uh, the uh, requirement for these kind of fine-tuned models is pretty low and i'm really hoping that uh, the model learns everything about me the gestures the movement of the head the facial expressions all of that and ultimately the ml pipeline the way i'm doing it is uh, i'm first sending a prompt to uh, claude 3.7 and the prompt looks like hey anish teach me kubernetes and claude 3.7 is going to come back with the text of a uh, one minute uh, approximate text on kubernetes for example and what the next step is going to be is uh, I'm going to have my facial gestures and everything and I'm using a lip sync model as well. And uh, ultimately, Polly is going to convert the text back into speech and then embed into my face. And so the ML part here is the very tricky part. I have an output where I'm using an external API called DID but I had to pay a monthly subscription for it and I'm not very happy in using that. And so I'm using SageMaker for my entire pipeline because SageMaker, if you know, all the training instances are uh, built only as long as you're going to be training. And I'm also using spot instances on top of that to control costs uh, even more. So I'm actually going to end up with around $5 for about four hours of uh, training. And uh, I believe this is a very current field. Uh, I, I have not seen solutions or I've seen solutions still in the making. And uh, I hope something like this would uh, inspire you to build your own product. And uh, I ultimately am going to take it down. I may not even build a front end for this and just will show the API from SageMaker to generate a video of me teaching Kubernetes. And so the difference between what a lot of products exist is uh, they ask you to upload an avatar but uh, the problem is the output is not you know based on my voice and not based on my gestures the way i talk you know the way i move my head and so i'm really hoping to cross that barrier with this project with that uh, please check out my uh, week, <laughs> week six video where i explain why i'm delayed more go into more detail on these models and show you the code and everything and i've been using Kiro. In my previous video or my previous uh, short, I explained what Kiro's and I'm really, really happy with it. And so um, even get on the wait list and hopefully before they start charging for it, uh, it uh, gives you an opportunity to build your own product. So keep building and uh, I will see you all in short videos really soon. As soon as I get some results out of these ML models or else. I might go into week seven and go from there. Have a great day, everyone.